Our Forgotten Harvest drivers start rolling out every morning, six days a week. They pound the streets in every kind of weather, face miserable traffic conditions, more miserable construction. But they don't stop until they've rescued and delivered fresh, healthy food for those in need. Food that will be on many tables that very same night. Our drivers, every single one of them, are true heroes every day. No one has a job quite like theirs. Meet two whose hearts, just like every driver in our fleet of 34 trucks, are as big as the trucks they drive. My name is John Whalen. Um, I'm a truck driver and I've been at Forgotten Harbors about four years now. What I see, I've seen people living on a couch. That's what I've seen. I've seen people living in a tent. You know, it's pretty pretty bizarre. I didn't, you know, and I know these things happen, but you just don't really realize it until you really see it. You know, and they're there when it's cold and they're there when it's warm and that was that's the toughest situation I've seen. One time I went to a place there's a Myers and this young girl was giving us she's about 20 give us giving us this food every day from the meat department. She did a really good job. Kept saying, "You do a really good job." What she did. And one day she comes up to me and she says, where do you guys distribute this food at around here? Because my brother is in super need of assistance and needs help. And I directed her to Waterford Senior Center and talked with them and got him hooked up with them so he'd go there and get the stuff that he needed. Me. And that was a pretty cool moment in this job. Yeah. My name is Darcy Gitchaway. I'm a driver here at Forgotten Harvest. I've been here a total of eight years. What drives me here is the, the, the fact that I help folks at the end of the day. I know I don't help somebody that's in need and, and me giving back. I love that. That's, I'm passionate about that, so I can't explain no other way but that. Just, just, just the hunger, the, the, the poverty, that people are really in, in, in need for food. It's, I mean, it, it, it can't get no um, simpler than that. 